on the side and let's see maghanap ako ng mga pictures na pwede natin pag-usapan, magtawanan together and yun so yun yung gagawin natin sa video na to you guys know how much I love skincare you guys know how much I love taking care of my skin more than putting on makeup but don't get me wrong guys, I still love makeup, I still love to play with makeup, it's just that I really prioritize my skincare first more than anything else so for this get ready with me video brought to us by common labs i am so so excited to share with you my recent skincare discoveries and of course my everyday makeup look probably some of you are still curious why um skincare is still a must for me more than makeup um, because simply guys, skincare really helps my skin to stay in a very good condition. It helps me prevent acne, um, treat wrinkles, keeps my face moisturized, glowing, and simply leaving my skin looking at its best. So I know guys, I have been sharing a lot of skincare products to you guys, but do know that I am in constant search of um, the best skincare products that will suit my current skin problems and i do have a really sensitive skin i have really really dry skin most especially on my jaw um dito sa side and under my eyes it really gets patchy it looks so dull and it's more prone to wrinkles and skin aging problems even if minsan lang ako magka acne if I do get acne, it's always a cystic acne, which is so irritating as it's sobrang sakit niya and para hindi ko alam kung paano siya iti treat and it always ends up leaving dark spots or dark marks on my face. Nahihirapan din ako maghanap ng skincare products for my face kasi sobrang bilis ma-irritate ng face ko. Whenever I use the wrong products or yung mga super strong products and whenever I eat unhealthy food, wala talaga, nagbe-break out ako. So, it's really, really hard for me to find skincare products. So, whenever I find good ones, I really make sure to share them with you guys. So excited to share with you that finally, I personally have tried one of the famous Korean skincare brands, which is Common Labs. The first thing that really made me fall in love with the brand is that um, they believe that true beauty comes from well-being and healthy body creates true beauty, which I really, really believe in. Common Labs skincare products are designed to really blend in your own skin. One of my favorite things about the Common Lab um, skincare products is that it really focuses on vitamins. And when I say vitamins, it's pure vitamins. Common Labs is not just a skincare brand, it's a vitamin skincare brand. And the effects of such protects your skin from irritation, from aging, from harmful elements, and it also boosts your skin's health. So now let's do our skincare, pero bibigyan ko lang kayo na super quick tip lang in case hindi niyo pa alam. If you guys are doing your skincare, always start with the lightest or most watery um, product down to the thickest or creamiest product. So I already washed my face. I also put toner on that. So first product that you'll be putting on my face is Vitamin E Calming Ampoule. I'm not sure how you pronounce that, but this one is definitely right away one of my favorites. Especially for those extra irritated skin days kasi nga, sobrang parating irritated yung face ko. This is really my go-to. Their packaging is in glass. And I really appreciate that it's in glass. And this one, has a dropper, so it's There, so it has a dropper. So I usually just put um, four drops on my palm, pat it on my face. It's super lightweight on my face. It's not sticky at all, and I love that the scent is really light. Para almost no scent tangasha, which is really really nice. So I like to use this product in the morning. You can actually use this morning and night. But I use this in the morning um, every day. Tingnan nyo naman yung face ko. I put some product already, pero hindi talaga siya oily. It's just, 
it looks moisturized, it looks healthy. And that is what I love about this product. And it calms my face, it protects my skin, and of course, it reduces um, inflammation. Which also I like, because I feel like sometimes yung face ko medyo puffy siya, especially pag kakagising ko lang. Sobrang puffy niya. That's why I like to use this in the morning as well. What's more amazing about this product, it has zero added water. Instead, they added 72% of tea tree extract. This is a highly concentrated product and it has a super soothing ampule to treat causes of skin trouble. And the four main ingredients of the product is vitamin E for soothing and protection, madecasticide for calming, gesalza to reduce inflammation, and tea tree leaf extract for sebum control. Moving on to the next product which I have been using for a week or so now. It's actually the vitamin C brightening gel cream. This product is definitely one of my favorites because I have dull and dry skin and this product treats both. So this product actually contains pure, guys, pure vitamin C and it has PHA and mandarin orange peel extracts to help smoothen your skin. May kasama siyang spatula here and you can put it however you want. Me, I use my fingertips forehead, my nose, chin, and cheeks. There. Guys, sobrang bango talaga niya. Like, it smells like orange talaga, which I love because it smells so natural. It smells so fresh. And it's super cooling, guys. As in, sobrang cooling siya sa face. Masyado marami ako nalagay. Masyado ako na-excite. Pero okay lang. You'll see pag nag-dry na siya how it changes my skin right away. I promise guys, I love this product so much because it gives me that moisture yet it doesn't make me look oily. Because I live in a tropical country in the Philippines and dito parang nasa, pag nasa bahay ka, okay, fresh ka pa. But once you go out, you start to get oily, right? So whenever I use moisturizing products, paglabas ko guys, sobrang oily ko na. But with this one, no, it doesn't make me look oily, which I love so much. And one of the things that I really appreciate with this product is that it's really lightweight. As in, imagine if you have a really heavy moisturizer and then magmi makeup ka pa. Parang ang kapal na nun sa face mo. The texture is light, it has non-sticky finish, and then super bilis niyang mag-absorb. Nakita niyo guys, gano'ng kadami yung nilagay ko kanina. Nag-dry na siya. Just like that. Super fast. So this is how my face looks like, guys. Just after putting these two products. Um, I love to combine them both. Um, again, this one is the Vitamin E Calming Ampule. And this one is the Vitamin C Brightening Gel Cream. I love to use both of these, especially in the morning. And I still have one more cream that I use at night naman which is the Vitamin E Calming Light Cream. This is my go-to whenever my skin needs calming and acne care. I'm gonna show you how the product looks like. I'm not gonna put it on my face because I use this at night. But I'll show you it There. So this is how the product looks like. So yung amoy niya, sobrang light lang. It kind of smells the same as this one. And this hypoallergenic um, barrier strengthening cream actually contains ingredients to um, inhibit sebum as it contains um, vitamin energy. It has 77.43% of tea tree extract. If you guys don't know what tea tree does, um, it actually has an excellent ability to treat acne and to lessen sebum. And all of the wonderful ingredients of this moisturizer are sure to tackle troubled areas of your face. So these two are my moisturizers. I use this one in the morning and guys, I use this one at night, most especially for those irritated skin days. And the reason why I want you to try this one out because the common lab solution for skin trouble uses vitamins, gasolza, and vitamin E to suppress inflammation and to protect your skin. For our last skincare products, napakadami pa nilang magandang skincare products. Pero this will be the last one that I'll be sharing with you guys for this vlog. We have the Vitamin E Micro Needle Spot Cream. This one is for calming and repair. My goodness guys, I promise. I'm so happy when they sent me this one. And finally, it worked on me. May nahanap na naman akong ibang product pa to help me treat my acne and acne marks or acne spots. What's special with this spot care cream is that it has micro needles that we cannot see. Like, I'm not sure how that works or paano nangyari yon, but promise it's effective. Micro needles in this product help open up the skin to absorb 
the nutrients from your skincare products and it also helps acne scars and spots lighten so how you use this is you just basically um, press the pump Ta-da! There! So, lumabas na yung cream. This is recommended to use every 2 to 3 days once applied because micro needles stay active up to about 70 hours. So, it's amazing, diba? Parang you don't need to waste a lot of products. It's super effective in just 2 to 3 days. It can be used morning or night. Um, recommended nila is you use this as the last step of your skincare para to avoid transfer to other parts of the face. I'm not actually sure kung saan ko siya ilalagay ngayon because I don't have any spots but i usually put this whenever i have acne or whenever i have acne marks or irritated parts of my face i have a tiny scar on my chin here and dito rin parang may konting something sa side ng nose ko and just wait for like two to three days and it will disappear like magic i promise i'm not even exaggerating but it is really really effective you can actually use this, guys, anywhere on your face that needs treatment, but um, it is not recommended to be used around your eye area because, again, guys, um, the skin around your eyes are very delicate. Um, it needs a different type of care. So, yeah, just use this whenever like you feel like my acne na kayo or you feel like my parang bumps or whatever. Just really put this one. So, just quick pump. I love the applicator there. You just need to put the right amount and then it will do its magic. And it only needs two to three days of application, and then voila! Okay, na guys, as in, you guys should really try this one out. So that is it. I'm done with my skincare. I'm so, so happy whenever I finish my skincare, most especially if I'm using my Common Labs products. Because I think it's a mix of everything. Like, number one, I know I'm not wasting my time for my skincare or my money from the products because I know they are really effective. Second is that I know that I am putting um, natural ingredients and pure vitamins on my face. Um, I don't like putting harsh products or you know harsh chemicals on my face and it gives me peace of mind. Peace of mind talaga! And third, um, I really really love how it feels on my face. Um, it's really lightweight, like I don't feel anything on my face at all even after putting all of the products but you can definitely see the difference. I mean, I can see it personally. I'm not sure if you can see it in the camera. So in case you guys want to try these products, I'm going to link it down below one by one. Or baka gusto nyo itry na rin lahat. And marami pa silang iba't ibang products that will definitely, definitely treat whatever skincare troubles you have. So I will link Common Labs down below in case you want to read more of them or find more products from them. Go guys, I would really vouch for Common Labs. I really fell in love with the brand when I started using it, so I promise guys, I'm gonna vouch for it. So after skincare, I usually fix my hair first because I like to let the skincare sink in my face talaga before I put on makeup. So now I'm gonna fix my hair. So I just decided to answer some questions about being flight attendant since feeling ko yun talaga yung ang dami nyo talagang tanong sa akin. So I'm done with my hair. Super bilis lang kasi may eksina siya. Now we're gonna head on to my everyday makeup look. It's really simple. It's really super quick lang. So quick background is that I used to fly for Philippine Airlines. Um, as a flight attendant international. So, yon. First is I'm gonna put on my concealer, which is usually the same product over and over again. One of your questions is how I applied for Philippine Airlines. I actually just applied through email. I found their email on their website. Um, tatry ko ilagay dito kung nahanap ko pa siya. But I applied through um, email only. A lot of my batchmates applied through mass um, hiring. Actually, marami sa kanila magkakakilala na because of the mass hiring ni Pal dati. So, ayun, I only applied through email. I just sent my resume with the photos and then they contacted me for an interview. So, I went to an interview in PNB building, the na kong inter first interview. So after that, I had to do a medical checkup. And then after that, I had another interview again. Don't usually yung mas personal questions na. So I don't quite remember so much about the interview kasi medyo matagal na siya. 2015? 2014 pa yata, guys. So 
Di ko na masyado maalala yung interview. But that's how I applied in Philippine Airlines. So next, I'm gonna head on to my eyebrows. Um, medyo okay lang naman siya, pero usually dinadagdagan ko lang yung length kasi I feel like my eyebrows are too short. Sa so, mga parating yung tiyatanong is if kung mahirap pa yung training sa PAL. Guys, um, feeling ko pinaka nag-aral ako nung nag-flight attendant ako because the passing rate is 98%. Meaning, two mistakes lang bagsak ka na. And then, you can only have three failures. So, tatlong bagsak lang. If you fail three times, if you fail more than three times, you're out of the training. So, ganun siya. Um, it, it looks like it's easy to be a flight attendant, but it's really not, especially the safety part. Like, ang dami mong aaralin word per word. And exams are usually fill in the blanks or enumeration. Walang very rare yung multiple choice or i think wala nga multiple choice you have to memorize different type of aircrafts so on my training i did the a320 a321 a330 a340 and boeing 777 so yun yung training ko and you have to memorize everything about each aircraft because they're they're different from each other and nalala ko pa talaga kung paano yung exam na yun is that parang my airplane na drawing insert ko dito kung meron pa pero like my airplane na drawing and then literally isasulat mo kung anong laman niya doon like no options at all as in dapat galing siya sa utak mo so yeah um the training in PAL was quite hard for me to be honest um dalawa kasi yung training safety and service so safety usually is the longest one service usually parang Two weeks lang yata in service, I'm not sure. So ganon, it's about memorization. Dapat parang muscle memory mo na lahat ng yon. And yon. So that's how training in PAL is. But it was really really fun. Um, though I think I wouldn't survive it without my friends in PAL during that training. Especially Joyce, my best friend ko. Dun ko siya na meet sa Philippine Airlines. Um, Trixie, Kat, Gonida, Daphne. Um, Okay, all of them, sila yung mga naging close ko talaga sa PAL. And without them, I don't think I can really survive PAL. Next, I'm gonna put on my contour. I never miss my contour because I have medyo malaki yung jaw ko. So, nagkakontour ako parate. Mahirap din yung training kasi usually, today yung lecture, tomorrow yung exam, right away. Um, so, ibig sabihin, pag uwi mo, mag-aaral ka na. And then, the next day is exam mo na. So, ganun siya. And then the service was the fun part where you can eat all the food because you need to memorize the food, the wine, and how to serve them and all to the passengers. So those were some fun um, parts of the training. We have a ditching class, so yun yung swimming. If you can't pass that, then you can never pass as a flight attendant because you need to be able to get the blush. So after the contour, I'm going to blush. Na ako. Um, I usually like to use really light blush and orangey blush. Why did I quit? Being a flight attendant. Um, being a flight attendant was one of like the best part of my life. To be honest, guys, hindi ko talaga pinagsisihan na nag flight attendant ako. Um, ang dami ko natutunan sa flight attendant, and the reason why I had to quit is because number one, um, hindi na kaya ng body ko. I really have low immune system. I always get sick every after flight because I like to fly the long haul flights and parati akong may sakit pag uwi ko. So, hanggang sa nagka pneumonia na ako, on getting worse and getting worse na lang. Parang hindi na talaga siya nagiging okay sa health ko. Plus, I am um, acidic. So, whenever I fly, I always get my acid attack. So, sobrang sakit guys. And then, we have stockings until our waist. Ang sakit pa rin, hindi ko alam kung paano. As in, minsan sumusuka ako sa lavatory kasi nga, sobrang sakit na ng chan ko. Nag-acid nag attack na ako and then nag-heartburn na ako. Especially on red eye flights. Meaning, yung madaling araw na flights. Usually, yun yung flights ng pa-US. Um, so, I like to use um, powdered eyeshadow kasi it's very natural. Parang hindi siya sobrang solid um, eyeliner which I really, really like. And then, usually, sa dulo ko lang siya nilalagay. I would have stayed a bit longer because I only stayed a year and a half and then I quit na ako. If only not for my health or not for my acid attacks and all of that, I would have stayed for like three, three years siguro, parang ganon. And one of your questions is, is it hard to be a flight attendant? In being a flight attendant, hindi siya madali. I did have a lot of 
unpleasant passengers, but I'm thankful for them. I learned so much from them, um, not just in my job, but also sa sarili ko. Ang dami ko talaga natutunan when I was a flight attendant. And if your dream job is to be a flight attendant, then go for it. Actually, my heart goes to all the flight attendants now and pilots who are not able, able to fly or probably lost their jobs because of the pandemic. Um, I pray for the whole aviation industry. But once bumalik ang lahat, um, go for it if you guys, if you really want to pursue your dreams. Really, really worth all the sleepless nights, all the yeah, ako umiyak ako during training. Um, yeah, everything. It's worth it if that's your dream job. It's not just gonna give you the perks of traveling around the world. It's not just gonna pay the bills, but it will definitely change you as a person, as in deep inside. Ang dami mong discover sa sarili mo when you are in that job. So this is my everyday look, guys. Sobrang bilis lang, sobrang konti lang ng ginagamit kong products. Um, cause I don't like anything heavy on my face and that's precisely why I really really invest on good skincare Para I don't need to put so much makeup on my face And yun din ang short kwentuhan natin about being a flight attendant Again guys, I'm gonna link down below all of the Common Labs products that I have been using I hope you can check them out I hope you would try them out I would really recommend all of them Thank you so much for watching I hope you leave me some love Like, like, like Comment down below kung anong videos pa yung gusto nyo and if you end up trying Common Labs, let me know down below. Thank you again guys and I hope to see you on my next vlog. Bye guys! Keep safe!